All right, we're back. We're gonna do some quality control testing now. We're gonna make sure these puppies actually work. Um, so we've got the whole bowl. Not bad. I mean, I think that's a pretty fair amount for one batch. You didn't use that many ingredients. I think cost-wise, this is a super good deal. Um, my kids love the bath bombs, but you know, even at Walmart, those cheapo ones are like two bucks a pop and who knows what's in them? I don't know. Um, I mean, I know what makes them fizz, right? But I don't know what other ingredients they're putting in there. So let's cross our fingers that um, this recipe, uh, which we know what's in it, works well. So let's pick out one of these small ones. There we go. You can almost see the snowflake impression of the mold. It's pretty cute. We might try with the salts mixed in next time, and maybe you can actually see the detail of the snowflake on the top. All right, but here we go. I got a little bit of warm water, just a small amount. It's not a whole bathtub. Let's see how it does here. All right, countdown. Three, two, one, drop it. There we go. All right, so we got a little fizz going. Oh yeah, oh, okay, I'm dumping it out, but let's show you here. Oh yeah. That looks fantastic. A lot of fizzing, a lot of bubbling. That's fun. I like that. I think that can be relaxing and soothing, right? And when it comes um, to be completely dissolved in the bath, it's gonna give you those Epsom salts, um, which have soothing properties in them. And then remember, we've also got the uh, coconut oil in there, um, helping to add a little moisture to your skin. The one thing that I'm noticing we don't get with this, which you do with a lot of the store-bought ones, is a lot of color while it's fizzing and popping. And um, I think for my kids, that's one of their favorite parts is that you can make it look like the ocean or a swamp or something like that. So we'll fiddle around with that a little bit. But for now, I'm happy with these results, guys. Definitely a winner. And they last, whoop, okay, it's falling apart on me now, but they are lasting a long time. All right, so definitely um, two thumbs up. You gotta try this one. And uh, I'll keep coming up with some more variations of it and share them with you so you can find your favorite. Take care.